Welcome, welcome, welcome into another Project Zomboid getting good in the zombified neighborhood episode. My name's Das Life. I am trying to get good. And boy, we had a terrible sleep last night. It was just awful. So let's um, maybe let's pull out the map and uh, yeah, let's make sure we never come here again. Slowly, slowly, slowly making our way. And intentional with the slow. But at this point now, it'd be nice to have uh, a neighborhood that I can retreat to. Things are relatively, relatively thinned out. This is standard apocalypse mode, so I'm not... This isn't 16x. <laughs> this isn't anything too wild. So it should be manageable with some patience. Well, there's a bunch of them, so <sighs> let's get let's get risky. Now, let's hope we get a generator mag in here. I almost don't want to go over there. I almost don't want to look. I want to be disappointed. Let's see what's back over here. Okay, close it behind me. Bathroom. Can't turn on the light. If I close the door. So at this point, we've actually lost power. Maybe it's not even there, but it's like the light switch. How long do you think it will take for me to figure that one out? The uh, hunt continues. Let's hop out. Let's take these out. gas. We have a number of them here. Maybe I'm too far. Maybe I need to be a lot closer. It's gonna be easier if I want to get closer to do this. Or maybe I do have to turn the car off. I, I'm not sure. But it was, you know, electricity might help. What is happening here? Do I need to be near the? gas tank. No, I think it's... Maybe I just can't click on it. Don't tell me the power's out already. Yeah! Yeah, that's the problem. It doesn't look like it. looks like there's light coming from this. I'm doing something wrong. Yes. I don't know what I'm doing wrong here. See, it's gotta be... Maybe it's the, something with the vehicle interface. So close. Whip. Primary. Come over here. Yeah, I can't take gas. Is it because the power is out already? It might be the power's out. Yeah, that's that right? Yeah. Yeah. There's no other
All right, day 15. We've, uh, we've water and power. Grab this gas can, because that's what we're going to need to uh, put into a generator at some point here. And now we really need to figure out a generator magazine. What are we going to do? We're going to take our frustration out on population, the general population. Now, if you're a zombie and you're just walking up to some dude who's just standing around casually smoking a cigarette, that's a good sign you probably should leave him alone. You know? I got a feeling that if you're a zombie, you're used to people going, ah, and running away. Ooh, spooky. It's a zombie. He's just sitting there smoking a cigarette, watching you, fingers lightly gripping a crowbar. That's, that's a, that's a sign you need to maybe go pick on someone else. That guy has seen some stuff and done some stuff. Wham, a chunk, a chunk, a chow, zippity, zip a pop, a chunk, a boom, do waka, do waka, diddle, dabble, do. Oh, we are rousy already. Well, I don't like that, so here's what we're gonna do. We are going to just eat a tea bag. Eat it all. Venue Mart. Oh. 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 Come on. Alright. Okay. 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 What? Let's go check over here. Hunter Magazine. Got the tab. I'll take the comic books. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> here, let's try. By sleeping in a car. Probably not the safest. I will leave the car running though. I think that will keep me safe, so let's sleep. Right here, let's fast forward a little bit. Now let's go to sleep. I think it's around 9 when the migration starts. I think it's... Oh, I'm getting queasy. Why am I getting queasy? Why am I getting queasy? Was it because I was next to the, uh... Next to the bodies? Could it be corpse? I think it's corpse sickness. Ah, I think it's corpse sickness. Or it's because it's so damn cold and I got the AC on. That could be it. Maybe I'm getting a cold. Step out. Hmm. I don't know. That queasy makes me a little, a little concerned. I haven't been scratched in a very long time. I do have some rotten cabbage. Gross. I, think I ate anything that was bad. Drop the rotten cabbage. Get ourselves. Let's eat something healthy. Yeah, I think it's because I left the AC on. I think I probably got. It's either that or because I was near corpses sleeping outside near corpses probably less than ideal all right so with that in mind let's drive ourselves somewhere where we can get a sleep let's see is this did i have a safe space here I cleared it turn off the car get out and let's see if there's a safe bedroom. I think there is. Ah, of course. I've destroyed the furniture. <laughs> I've destroyed the furniture. 
Okay, let's maybe I can can sit here, rest a little bit, and uh, I'm gonna eat. The heat's going down. Maybe I'll take the take the coat off. I don't think washing is going to help me. Oh, oh, oh okay. We got rid of the queasy. Yeah, we got a, quite a few over here now. Now. Gummy bears. Helped a little bit with the sadness. Uh oh. I kind of have too many. Kind of have too many chasing me. And there's some more coming. There's a lot more back that way. I've made an oopsie. I have engaged far too many. And I can knock out a few. This is, this is, uh, this is, this is a mess. Go quickly, quickly, quickly. <laughs> yeah. Yep. 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 Remember how I shut off the gas, too? I was thinking as I got out, like, oh, this is a manageable group, but I'll shut off the gas to help save some of the gas. I always try to lose them in the trees, but I don't really know what's up that way. I'm going to loop around this building and see how many I can lose over here by the knocks. Now, we always have the big, the big fence if things get really out of control. I think I hopefully gave them gave a good chunk of them the shake, or at least for now. These are the things that get me killed. These are the moments, and I'm, I'm telling myself this, and I'm telling you this, in hopes that I actually don't push my luck much this time. Uh, and so maybe this is one of those moments where I should also try to knock the panic down by taking one of these, these beta blockers. I'm a little sad. But maybe this will make me happy. Maybe. Maybe killing them will. You know, knowing a. You know, taking the pride in a job well done. That would be actually something that would be a nice way to deal with, you know, unhappiness if you're a. If you, if you build something and it turns out pretty good. Be a nice way to knock down the, the sadness. 
as a mechanic. I think that's fun. All right, well, let's let's hurry back to the car. Here's the school. We didn't find books there, but let's get past. All right, we've got a few dead down here. What is this? That was uh, that restaurant or something. All right, we've got a lot here. Let's leave the gas on this time. There's a lot down this way. And it takes a bit of work with the crowbar. Okay. Got a few down here. Be careful. Let's do the beta blockers. Let's try to... Take advantage of... Let's minimize the... Moodles as much as possible. Okay. Well, we're getting uh, some workout on our nimble. Probably getting nothing. Closer to the car, which means I'm closer to that group that was ahead of me. Let's get a couple. This one's on attention on me. We're over a thousand, one thousand seven kills. This could be a this could be a personal best for a first time character. For, a, for the you know starter world. I do a lot of treating it like it's permadeath. But I'm I'm happy with that. We broke a thousand. Happy with that, but I'd like it to keep going. I think it was some, some bad luck to have the both water and electric go out within the first just over two weeks. I believe that you've got any time kind of in within the first 30 days that could happen. So I don't know if it's if your electricity or if your water goes out early, if it means that the electricity is also likely to go out early. I don't know if they're related in any way, if it was just bad luck on both counts. But we we got that katana. That was a really nice, really nice luck. That helped quite a bit. Big groups down here, so maybe that means that all the good stuff's down here. Now, if it is, I'm in trouble because I don't have much storage space anymore. <laughs> anyway. It's been a while since I've gone back to uh, to reload or to empty the empty the sack. That's what she said. I don't mind if I'm gonna walk backwards. Oh, oh, oopsie. That's why I want to make sure I've got enough space. I'm starting to get a little... A little tired. And that certainly could be what gets me killed. Assuming that I probably don't hit as hard when I'm tired. And let's see what I can do.
Probably not the best way to do this, but it is fun. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, I'm slow off the pivot at the exertion. That's the stuff that gets me killed. I can only walk and fight for so long. Alright, we're gonna push, push, pivot. Should have. I wanted to go in, but I'm anxious. Three. There we go. Come on. Good night, Gracie. All right, let's sit down here for a minute. Get a rest. All right, we get we're drowsy. What can we do? Got chocolate covered coffee beans. Let's eat all of these. Get the tiredness down a little. Still close to being tired. So do a quick pivot. So we're going to next move on to the vitamins. Right, we're not as uh, not as exhausted. Drying off. Let's go ahead and have a smigarette. All right, let's get up, go back to the car. Making a mess here. Making a mess. Let's see how many. Who wants to come? Who sees me? Yeah, this is, this is rough being tired like this. Or so close to being tired. This is a mite bit dangerous. And it's slow. It's slow, but effective. I don't know about trying to sleep in one of these buildings. They don't exactly look inviting. I'm you know, probably sleeping in a hard chair. Just gonna put me in a sleep deficit again. Come here, you. Come here, you too. Hey, come on out. Come on out. Oh, we got a couple on the back door. That's what she said. Or he said. I think I caught the eyes of a couple of different little friendos. So when I talk about being a player in training, I don't want to just survive, hold up somewhere. I want to grind weapon skills. I want to be strong. I really want to get good. I don't want to just learn how to go hide from zombies and live in the woods. Although, that can be pretty dangerous in its own right. There's the tired Moodle again. Alright, we're going to go back to the Vitamins. That should be okay. Help us out for a little while. Maybe I should check in here. Oh, look, there's even more. Oh, man. There's so many out here. I'm just not getting very... <laughs> if, I, if I'm 
making clearing these the prerequisite for getting further and further south. I can see why this is gonna, going to be a problem. It's getting late enough. I think I should just regroup, rest up, come back. We will get there. Yeah, we will get there. It's just gonna take take patience. Remember, patience, patience, patience. Ooh, there's a trailer on that vehicle. I like the look of that. Okay, this is that. I kind of know a little bit about this community. Oh, maybe not much. Yeah, it'll be a while until I've got this whole place nice and safe, huh? And that actually might be a never situation uh, in terms of never actually have this place safe. Uh, let's kill a few more. Get a nice rest in the car. Feeling good. We got a, at least a little few more ticks before the sleepiness hits. Hopefully we don't have too many more following. We got a little bit. I, w I do want to keep it generally zombie free around my base before I tuck in for the night. Good. Dark in here. It's 1 a.m. We're awfully sleepy. Let's go to sleep. We've done our best to put off being sleepy and having had some bad bed. So this is a good quality bed. Had an average sleep and that just set everything off. Made things rather challenging. So, all right. This will be where we'll pause. Uh, a little sleepy. Do with a lie down. A little peckish. But feeling awfully good about setting a new personal record. Thank you for coming along this journey with me. I will see you on the other side.